Today's lesson is about arc length and the sector area. First of all, let's analyze the formula given in the SL formula chart. We got the length of an arc, L equals theta times R. For this theta, remember two things. First of all, the unit is a radian. And a second, this is theta refer to the central angle. So for given L equals theta times R, if we want to solve this theta, you need to divide it by R both sides. So you get the theta equals L over R. If you are given arc length and a radius, the theta will be equals L over R. Let's still look at the L equals theta times R. How we work out this R? You have to get rid of this theta by doing divide theta both sides. Therefore, for this R equals L over theta, if you are given arc length and uh, theta, central angle in radian, then the radians will be L over theta. For area of a sector, this theta stands for the same thing, radian and also central angle. For this area equals one half theta times r square. If we want to solve for this theta, this is a linear pattern. You have to isolate this theta on one side. I want to get rid of this two by doing multiplication of two both sides. I want to get rid of this r square. You have to divide it by R square both sides. Therefore, you got the theta equals 2a over r square. If I want to solve for r that radians, we know this is a power pattern. Therefore, you need to isolate this r square on one side. I get rid of this 2 by doing multiplication to both sides. I want to get rid of this uh, theta. I have to do divide by theta both sides. So I got r square equals 2a over theta. How can I get the r? I have to do square root of both sides. Therefore, I got the r equals square root 2a over theta. Now we write down this uh, two formula. Theta equals 2a over r square. And uh, for r equals square root 2a over theta. Now let's go to some examples. Find the r class s and also the area of each sector A. For number 1, 102 degree, that's the central angle. But when you use R times theta, remember theta is in radian. You have to change 102 degree into radian. This is the formula for radian and a degree exchange. Radian equals degree over 180 times pi. Degree equals radian over pi times 180. Therefore, for radian theta, you will get 102 degree over 180 degree times pi. We got this is a radian. Then, for the arc length, S equals 
radius is 1.5 times 102 degree over 180 degree times pi. We put this into calculator, you will get 2.670 inches. For the area, you will get one half times 1.5 square. Then times the theta, that's 102 degree over 180 times pi. So we put into calculator, you will get 2.003 inches square. Now let's go to number two. For number two, when we're looking for this uh, arc length, the central angle is a four pi over three. And uh, also this is given in radian. Therefore, just you need to directly plug in to this formula. Radiance is a 3.4 times 4 pi over 3. Then we put into calculator, we will get 14.242 meters. For sector area A equals 1 over 2. Radiance is a 3.4 square times 4 pi over 3. We put into calculator, we will get 24.211 meters square. Now let's go to number six. Find the measure of angle theta in radians and degrees. For number six, we are given, this is the arc length. That's L equals 15 feet. And a uh, radians equals 4.5 feet. Theta equals L over R. So we got 15 over 4.5. That is a 3.333. Remember the unit is a radian. Then how change this uh, radian into degree? You have to make a 3.333 divided by pi times 180 degree. Put into calculator, you will get 109.986 degree. For number 8, we are looking for this uh, theta. But we are given this... Uh, sector area the central angle is not theta it's this angle so we assume this angle equals alpha according to the formula given theta equals 2a over r square but this theta is a central angle for this problem central angle is a alpha equals 2 times 7 over 2 square, you will get the 3.5. What's theta will be? Theta equals one circle that's 2 pi minus this alpha 3.5. You will get 2.783 radian. We need to change this radian into degree you got to do 2.783 over pi times 180 degree. 159.454 degree. That's for the answer for this uh, theta.